from the IHTN studios, it's Braves Beat. Good morning, Indian Hill, and welcome to Braves Beat. I'm Mitchell Trout. And I'm Mallory Chadwick. Let's get thick with it. Everyone's favorite production of the year is quickly approaching, Pow Wow. This year's show is how to succeed in business without really trying. The show takes place on February 20th to 22nd at 7.30 p.m., and there will also be a matinee on the 22nd at 2 p.m. Tickets are $10 for students and $12 for adults. This year will be the inaugural DECA Dodgeball fundraiser. It will be held on January 27th. Sign up for teams will be held on both block days of next week in room 121. Please see Drew Fowler for more information. If you can dodge traffic, you can dodge a ball, so be sure to sign up. For those of you who don't know, the annual DECA competition starts next Tuesday. Here's Jason Libman with all you need to know about DECA. DECA, what is it? DECA is an international marketing organization that provides around 50 competitive events to high schoolers around the world. There are two types of events. There are the role play events and there are the written events. Depending on the particular event, the role plays are given solo or with a partner. When doing a role play, you are given a situation and time to then prepare with the situation. After the prep period, you will then give your presentation to a judge who will score you. All role plays are accompanied with 100 question tests. However, with the written events, only those who create 11 page papers have to take the test. The 30 page manuals, on the other hand, just have to give their presentation based off of their paper like the 11 page papers also have to do. An example of a topic is a revitalization of a local small business. DECA competition consists of three levels. The district's event, which Indian Hill will be competing in this Tuesday. The state event, which takes place in Columbus for Ohio. And finally, if you advance far enough, the granddaddy of them all, the international competition, which will take place in Atlanta at the beginning of May. Good luck to all Indian Hill DECA students in our quest for DECA domination. And that was DECA in 60 seconds. Shout out to all you DECA destroyers out there. The Indian Hill Latin Club is hosting a community service event this Saturday, February 1st at Matthew 25 Ministries from 1 to 3 p.m. Please show up and earn your white hours with your friends. Community service sheets will be provided. In sports news, the boys basketball team takes on Wyoming tonight for senior night and the winner will gain sole possession of the first place in the CHL. Come out in your decade outfit and be ready to, to go to the dance that follows. In other news, wish our wrestling team good luck as they will be giving a beatdown on Reading to win this title of the CHL champions. Finally, the Aqua Braves also compete in the CHL championships at Marymount tomorrow, so come out and be loud, be proud, and support student athletes. Now let's go, let's go check in with Alex Foster with impromptu interviews. If you could make up a spirit day, what would it be? Definitely Paige. Monday. You just dress like me. How do you dress? Like really cute and fun. <laughs> Super cute and fun. Mr. Ryan Hill, if you could invent a spirit day, what would it be? I would have to say um, tank top. Be tank top and beach Wednesday. I will smash that camera. <laughs> it's just you and me. It's just you and me. There's no camera. It's okay. Now look into my eyes. Jimmy, if you could invent a spirit day, what would it be? Alex Day. So, Mr. Atwood, how does it feel to be the most attractive teacher at Indian Hill? With or without the beard? With. I don't know, I'm scared right now. If I had to make a spirit day, it would be Mitchell Day because he's quiche. The Hope Foundation is holding a school-wide event called Totes for Hope after school on Wednesday, February 12th. Just $15 will get you a custom tote bag and admission into the event, where there will be painting, food, and fun. If you're looking for a fun way to earn white hours, make sure to sign up in Mrs. Schoenauer's room, 121, today. Before we go, we'd like to remind you to like our Breezebeat Facebook page, follow us on Twitter, subscribe to us on YouTube, and email us with any school updates. Don't forget, the pep rally will begin today at 1.55. Purchase your tickets during lunch or at the dance for w the Winter Decade Homecoming. Get ready to dress up and get down with it. Have a good day, Braves. And don't just have a good day, have an American day. And as always, stay classy, Indian Hill. And the world's cat tumbling down in the city that we love.